Good afternoon, Spring Valley community. This is your principal's message for May 5th, 2023. So we'd like to give a big shout out to all of our finalists who competed in the finals for the Spelling Bee. We had a great showing. Uh, we'd like to thank Ms. Zar for putting everything together for the Spelling Bee and all the teachers that worked up to it and tested their classes. And of course, the wonderful students that all participated, all of our students, and our students that went on to represent us at the finals. The Spring Valley had a great showing and we're very proud of that, so thank you. Also, big shout out to our track and field athletes who will be moving on. They have a big meet at Buchanan, they all qualified for, and Spring Valley and the mountain area track meet um, had an incredible showing, both boys and girls, so we're very proud of them and we wish them good luck tomorrow. Thank you to Coach Fulmer and Show, Show for all the time you put into our kids. So state testing starts on Monday. We put out a message yesterday just encouraging you to pump up the kids, make them, uh, get them well fed, plenty of rest, and focus on that test. We want to be proud that we want them to be proud of their growth and their scores, as well as showing pride, warrior pride, and coming out and making our school um, demonstrate just how great we are. So Monday that starts. We're going to stretch it out over two weeks, um, not because we love two weeks of testing, but because we're going to do it in small doses. Um, so. We appreciate that. Our talent show is Monday, May 8th at Yosemite Lakes Community Church at 6 p.m. Uh, thank you to Miss Von Wagner for all the work that she's put in. All the kids will be rehearsing Monday afternoon. Uh, the Spring Valley Showcase is on May 18th at 6 p.m. Um, come see our students showcase um, all that they've learned this year. They're really going to be in the spotlight. It's traditionally our open house. We rebranded it Showcase because the focus is on showcasing the students and all that they've learned and put them on the platform to show you the incredible skills that they have. So we expect everyone to be out there on that night. The Candyland Family Dance, that's TK through 5th, will be on Friday, May 19th at 5.30 p.m. What a fun uh, way to give a dance to our younger kids and just to celebrate families and just to celebrate, uh, you know, the, uh, celebrate our youngsters. It's always a blast. We'll have a DJ, we'll have food. It's gonna be a, a really good time. So we hope to see all our families there. The Design the Garden Challenge is gonna, the finalists are gonna be on May 25th. So they've been working, they've been using project-based learning and their standards in their class for a Design the Garden unit. So there's a lot of different variations. This is our TK through our fourth graders. And each class is going to pick a representative. Um, and I just am so excited. We're going to have some judges come in and, and score them on that day. But we're going to celebrate um, our, our students' creative minds, their innovation, and their hard work, of course. So the Spring Valley Garden Luau, is uh, we got some momentum going. We're selling a lot of tickets. That's going to be on June 3rd at 6 p.m. at Spring Valley the parent event of the year and it's all going to go to our our garden and outdoor um, instructional facility educational facility uh, we're going to be doing some sneak peeks of what that garden's going to look like uh, we got our grant we're matching that with our luau funds this is just the first of many luau's at spring valley um, you could still get your tickets i believe last time i checked we're uh approaching 120, 130 tickets sold at this point, maybe a little bit more. Um, and we're shooting for just above 200, um, but we can accommodate even more than that. So if you haven't get your ticket, got your tickets, go ahead and get, get your ticket because they're, that's a hot ticket, all right? So uh, we're also looking for some donations for live auction, silent auction. We have people like Took Chansey and Southgate and some others donating some of those. Also, sponsorships. So I'm going to do a special video next week about how you can sponsor um, be, and how you can be recognized, your business, your family, whatever you'd like to be a part of this history. Um, I'm going to put out a video with those details. But if you'd like to be a sponsor, you can let us know. Uh, we actually like to give a shout out to our, our first big corporate sponsor, and that is uh, the Picayune Rancheria of Chickchansee Indians. They gave us a $5,000 donation as well as a live auction item um, as one of our first corporate sponsors. So keep those coming. We love it. This is all for the kids. Um, so at the end of the year, as we get closer, classes are going to be going on some fun excursions. We have some field trips. In fact, today that we got a lot of people out. We had Sugar Pine. We had uh, Heritage Days. We had Great America. We have sixth graders going to Scout Island pretty soon. 
And towards the end of the year, the last couple of weeks, we're going to go on some fun excursions, some movie days, some Defy. Um, so that's just a way to celebrate our students' good attendance, their grades, their hard work on all the assignments they've done, as well as the state tests, and just celebrate the end of the year. So those will be coming up. We'll keep you posted on that. As we host all these end of the year activities, it's going to be very busy for a few weeks. We just want everyone to remember that dogs are not allowed on campus for a variety of reasons. That's actually a law, but we just want folks to remember to be respectful of those laws. Um, keep our campus safe. It is a dog-free campus for those events. So please leave the dogs at home and we thank you for respecting those rules. Uh, that is all we have for today. We thank you for being such a great community. We thank you for your support. It's been wonderful. My first year as principal here, what a blessing. I am so thankful for all of you. Warrior heart, warrior spirit, warrior mind. Go Warriors.